least of all that rain, the windows are white, uh, cleaner today. <laughs>
today must be early in the morning over there for you uh, good morning the song. <laughs> <laughs> 6.22 over there. Cool, you get up early, Mona. How's the weather over there, where you are? It's horrible here. Rain all morning, we've had to take everything down in the rain. We got soaking wet. We're going to have to put it all back up in the We're wet. We're going to have to put it all back up in the wet. <laughs> fun, fun, fun. And we never ran. Yeah, we never ran around, did we? No. No. Mind you, we've got to put it up yet. <laughs> we never ran around. We was laughing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> laughing because we were so wet. <laughs> It was terrible. Trying to put the awning into a bed. Ah, uh, no, we never even bothered trying to do that. I tell you what, trying to put an awning into a bag is like trying to put a, a square peg into a round hole. <laughs> it don't work. Ah, uh, fun times, fun times. In the end, we just opened the door and bunged it in. <laughs> the awning is absolutely soaking wet. Well, God knows what that's going to be like getting out. That's going to be fun. Yeah. Getting that out, putting it up, soaking wet. Yeah. So we're on the way to uh, Barry for Easter. We're there for 11 nights. It's still dark. I've been up since four. Wow. Why you get up so early? <laughs> wow, four o'clock. Early bird catches the worm.
Oh, that is early. It's one o'clock. Couldn't you sleep? Candy man was up at six this morning, wasn't you? Yeah. And I was up at seven. We was at the we was at the campsite by ten. Quarter to ten. Quarter to ten. We was at the campsite by. It's only because it was raining. <laughs> we got done everything pretty quick. It's the quickest we packed away before, isn't it? Yeah. But very very quick it was. Went to bed early last night. Ah, yeah. That's the thing. If you go to bed early. Then obviously you get up early. Don't ya? It's always the way. So I only need about six hours, kit me. 70 miles to go. I don't I don't need much sleep. If I the more I sleep in, the more I get I get headaches and all that when I wake up. So I, I only have about six hours, kit. <coughs> That'll do me six hours, that's enough. Unless I've had a few drinks down me. <laughs> then, I, then I sleep a bit more. <laughs> Like then, if it's still dark out there, you'll probably get some sunshine, hopefully, or some warm weather. Is it warm over there at the moment, or is it quite chilly still? Got any liquid sun? Welcome, Tanya. Hi, good morning to you. How are you doing, guys? Hope you're doing okay. How's Cambridge? Have you got the same weather as us? So bad here yesterday, uh, today. Horrible, horrible weather. We've got, we've got winds as well coming. It's alright at 6 o'clock this morning. Yeah. The sun's on. Huh? The sun was out at 6 o'clock this morning, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. And then it just went gone. See you later. That was the last we saw of the sun. <laughs> <laughs> Only 31 degrees here right now. Oh, so that's a bit chilly for you guys. That's a bit chilly for you, isn't it, Mona? 31. I hope you've got your fire on. You're nice and warm in your uh, in your van. How's your little doggy, Mona? Is that Mona, Mona? Yeah, Mona. My friend. <laughs> She's a gorgeous little doggy, she is. I love the way she sits on your, uh, uh, your, your, wheel, your wheelchair. Love that. Not wheelchair, it's a scooter sort of thing, isn't it? Yeah. Mobility scooter. Yeah, little mobility scooter. Yeah, little mobility scooter. I've been busy doing my skip with rubbish. It's sunny today, I'm out. It's still sunny in Cambridge. Oh. We're going the wrong way. <laughs> filling your skip out. What are you filling? What are you doing with your skip, Malcolm? What are you putting in your skip? Are you having a good old clear out? I'd like to have a rummage through it. Ah, oh, yeah, I bet you would. Yeah. Got to do some sewing today. Ooh, ooh what are you sewing? I used to do sewing at school. Oh, you don't do it? I don't do it now. I learned how to sew at school. I want a button sewn on, I've got to do it myself. Yep. How 
household crap he's putting in the skip. Um. Uh, yeah, Candyman would love to have a rummage through that, wouldn't you? Yeah. <laughs> he likes crap. <laughs> One man's rubbish is another man's gold. <laughs> Mona Malcolm and Tanya who's in at the, on at the moment, they're from um, the UK. They're from a, a place called Cambridge down south of the UK. It's a big 12 yards one. Oh. <laughs> Malcolm and Tanya Mona who lives in the United States she's a lovely lady she's a true patriot she does a really good uh, speech on the old ragged flag which we love to hear every time Mona do you, you live in Texas don't you I'm sure it's Texas today that beautiful sunny Florida it will be turning 15 gal water barrels into shop cool poles I've used them to hold down the gazebo no I live in a oh you're in a Bradston motor Oh, you in the front. Oh, well, okay. I know what they are. Shit, the tall poles. Well, I'm not quite sure what they are. Candyman probably knows what they are. What? on Facebook I'd like to see them that'd be great to see well that'd be a good bridge to do a flag wave for wouldn't yeah. it hey yeah. there ain't no bridges of uh, barriers there uh, not near anyway. We could do one over the sea. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to see their pictures. I'll get into this campsite until um, two o'clock this afternoon. So we're going to be a little bit early. This is here. 
Oh, that's right, Ed. Just after. I reckon they're getting it. Yeah. Wait. What's this chat with all the main? I know, it's right. Ch chit chat. Uh, it's just but it's just pouring down here, Shereen. Absolutely pouring down all morning. It's just horrible. 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 We got soaking wet this morning, Serene. Absolutely soaked. But we're okay. We, put, we shoved the awning in the van, that's soaking wet. We're coming to Florida, Shereen. We're coming. Coming to Florida, get a bit of sunshine. It is early in America, Malcolm. It is very early. That's what, I was going to go live a little bit earlier about 10 o'clock over here but then it would have been six o'clock in the morning over there uh well eastern time that is anyway and that would have been far too early no one had been up then except for mona mona would have been up <laughs> oh she really says she's waiting on us to come over there. We'll be there. We'll be coming over. We've got to visit you and Kerry. See Freedom in Florida. We've got to visit, I think LA Forgiving lives in Florida as well. I think she does, I'm not quite sure. Abigail, got to visit her, got to visit loads of people. Central time, ah yeah. 6.37 central time. Yeah, we've got eastern time, central time. What's California? I always say California time, I don't know what that is. I know they're eight hours, seven hours at the moment. Oh, our clocks go back this week. Our clocks go forward this weekend. So we we'll lose an hour. Lose an hour's kick. That's not good. I will get, I will get, I've seen you, um, I've seen you there, Mona, but I, I will uh, Google it. Yeah, Branston, yeah, I will. I will come to Branston, we will come to Branston as well, visit you as well. We'd love to see you and meet you. And you can tell us all about the ragged old flag. Yeah. Yeah, we'd love to meet you. Uh, we, we love you, Mona, we really do love you so much. Summertime, yeah, not so much, Malcolm. <laughs> Even though the clocks are going forward, we ain't got no summer over here yet. It's seven forty where Shireen is in Florida. Yeah, yeah we'll definitely go to Branston. Yeah, I'll have to Google that and have a look at it and see what it's like there. with everyone. Maybe we could do a convoy. <laughs> Rail is our summertime, how could book? <laughs> yeah, you're right there, mate. Yeah, I'm going to watch that, Mona. I'm definitely going to watch that. Always watch the convoys. I love watching the convoys. 
yeah, definitely be watching that on the 8th and the 12th of November. Yeah, definitely. I wish we could get over there for then, but I don't think we're going to be able to. But I'd love to get over for that. See how it goes. I mean, November's a long way yet. It's just a ball, though, that's all. We haven't got really, we haven't got no one to look after us for, look after her for us. My mum can't look after her, because she's too strong for my mum. Put me on a campsite. Huh? Put, put me on a campsite for a couple of weeks. Yeah, well, we'll be at um, Stanmore then. Yeah. yeah, I might be able to come over. I don't know if Candyman will be able to get over, because he'll have to look after Aurora, but I might be able to get over for that. Because we'll be parked up again for four months on November the 1st, so I could fly over, say, the 5th, couldn't I? Oh, election day. I'll fly over election day and celebrate it all with you when Trump gets in power. Oh, that'd be great. Oh, yeah, I'm going to really seriously think about that, Mona. I'm going to try and get over in November. Trump wins on the 5th and we celebrate on the 9th. Oh, OK. Well, I'll definitely try and get over. Because Candyman can look after Aurora. Then I can come over. Oh, I'd love to ride with you in the, in the, in the convoy. Oh, that would be awesome. Oh, that's a dream. Oh, I'd love to, yeah. Yeah, definitely going to seriously think about that one. Oh, look at that little car. Oh, it'll be blown off the road. Yeah, I could do that, couldn't I? Yeah, definitely. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Then I'd have to. Uh... Shireen, you'd have to meet us at the con. Uh, you, uh, you'd have to come to the convoy. We could. You can ride in with the oh wow that would be absolutely amazing oh can you imagine me in one of their trucks I'm going ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> oh I would love that oh that would be amazing absolutely amazing oh can you imagine <laughs> I've got a massive big smile on my face just thinking about that, Mona. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna get I'm definitely gonna get over to you. a few hot spots guys so stick with us stick with us there will be a few hot spots as we go along the road we'll be along here yeah big oh is there all oh, right don't forget to press that like button guys oh yeah my watermark watermark there we go Tracy, hi darling, how you doing? A pickup truck will see if old Bruce in the old fall for the cold ground. Ah, oh, yeah. Getting coffee, Shireen is. Okay, Shireen. If old Bruce. Ah, oh, that I'd love to meet Bruce. I'd like to meet everyone. X-ray and ah, oh, everyone. 
I like to be Big D, Hippie Mama, I like Shireen, Storm, um, Sherry, Storm, Kentucky, everyone. I would love to meet everyone. It'd be a dream come true meeting all you guys. No speeding, Candyman, Tracy's foot. I'm not, I'm doing 50 miles an hour. <laughs> I bet I'd love to be his passenger. Oh, oh yes, De Bona, I'm definitely, 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 definitely going to be thinking about that now, coming over in November. I could fly over, say, on the, I don't know, what, what is it? The, I could fly over on the 5th or the 6th, or even the 7th, maybe. Probably a little bit. I, I'd, I'd probably fly over about the fourth, maybe the fourth or the fifth. Yeah, and celebrate Trump going in power with you all as well. Bring me Trump flag over with me, the J6 flag coming over. Mind you, the J6 is hopefully be out as soon as Trump gets in power, so that'd be good. After point six miles, exit the highway. Would he be able to put up with me though? That's the thing, Mona. You should have seen us this morning. We were soaking wet, girl. And we didn't have any arguments. We was laughing our heads off. But we got put up yet, so... There might be a few arguments. <laughs> but you didn't need your referee shirt this morning. We was all right. And we left a big damp patch on the grass. <laughs> Patch. A big bald patch on the grass, which I don't think they liked. <laughs> really, all it was. <laughs> the owner actually came over and said goodbye to us. I think he was more looking at the grass than saying goodbye to us. <laughs> He's poor grass. So you got plenty of rain, make that green. Yeah. Fly in and we can pick you up from Springfield. Oh, right, okay, thanks for letting me know. I'll have a look at the, um, see how much the flights are later on tonight. I'll have a look at that in, uh, I'll see how much the flights are in November. They should be quite reasonable in November because obviously it's not the height of the summer and everything. They shouldn't be too bad. I did look at the flights going into Birmingham, Alabama. And they were around about £600, but that was with a stopover as well. Because uh, obviously, obviously Sweet Home Alabama Kim, I want to go and see her. I'm, I can't go to America and not see my, friend, my best friend Kim. So I'd have to go, I'd have to fly over to Alabama or she could come and see, come to you for the convoy. That would be great. That would be awesome, that would, if Kim could come on the convoy as well. Um, so yeah, I'll have a look at the flights tonight when I'm sitting down and having a glass of wine. So that's Springfield, Princeton Airport. we we'll see how much the flights are. Going over the bridge. Going over the bridge. Let me just write that in my, uh... Uh, I'll 
just having a look. There we go, that's the apple. The shoot, Suri. Right, I've got that on my phone now, so I'll have a look later and bore into that and see how much that is to get over to you. Yes, you can come to me and they will all come to you. Yeah, definitely, Mona. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, oh, Amazon. Look at that. It's massive. Let us know. Hot spot. Bloody Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Donna Ray. How you doing, sweetheart? Hope you're doing okay today. Um, Shireen, yeah, that would be awesome if uh, people could help. But I'm not asking for help. But if they wanted to donate, they can. That's not that. That would be awesome. If you come to the states, you'll have to come to San Antonio. Yeah, I know. But it looks like, Tracy, I might be coming over in November. So, yeah. That's it, I've got to close you want to look for Springfield Mall Airport. Right, okay, let me just put that in my phone and, uh, yeah, because we're going to be parked up for four months in November like we did this year, last year. So Candyman can stay at the campsite and look after Aurora and I'll fly over and meet all you guys so this is a plan that I've got now this is going to be awesome if I can do that Springfield Mall Airport right got it thank you I've got that uh... thanks Mona yeah I've got that airport I'll have a look into that later and see how much the flights are. You don't have to ask Rose, we all love you, just let us know what we need to do to help. Okay, thank you Shireen, thank you so much, I appreciate you guys, I really do. But this is going to happen now, I think, because this is going to be a plan, yeah, definitely. Because it's a good idea, because we'll get, Terry, we'll get County Man uh, camped up, and then I can fly over, we get camped up on the 1st of November. And then I'll fly over on maybe the 4th or the 5th to 6th, it depends. Uh, I don't know what, I don't know about flying up. What do you think, what do you guys think about flying over on election day? Do you think it's a good idea or a bad idea? I'm getting all excited now for this. Very, very excited. Oh, that's a bit comfy. Candy man don't mind missing me, do ya? He do, he'll have fun without me. <laughs> and I'll be live streaming as well, so he can be able to see everything, won't ya? Yeah. He'll be able to watch it all. I have said for two years now that I am going to get a Mona hug, but God has not planned that in my plan yet. Oh, Shireen, maybe in November God will plan it in your plan. Going over the bridge. Sorry? Not We're going over the bridge. We're going into Wales, guys. We're going into Wales. Look how great and miserable it is. Like it was last year. <laughs> <laughs> We're in Wales. Goodbye, England. See you soon. Yeah, hopefully, uh, yeah, Donna Ray, I'm going to come over in November because I'm going to go and ride um, in Mona's truck for the, in the convoy. So I'm definitely coming over in November. I have to be. Hopefully in November, Shireen, God will put that in your plan. I'm going to pray that you, he will. I'm going to pray for you, Shireen, that he will do that. Did you trace? Oh, that's awesome. I can't wait to meet Mona. I really can't wait to meet. I can't wait to meet everyone. 
It's going to be awesome. I'm so looking forward to it. I'm, I'm, I'm really excited now. Really excited. Yeah, I'm coming over, guys. I'm coming over in November. <laughs> Woohoo! Ooh, wait till I tell Sweet Home Ella about the kid. <laughs> She's gonna have to come and meet me. <laughs> it's gonna be a big hug fest. It is, it definitely is, Donna Ray. It's definitely gonna be a big, and a big tear fest as well, because I'll be crying with happiness. You know what I'm like, guys? I'm going to be crying with happiness. Yeah, Tracy, you had the honour of meeting Mona and meeting everybody as well. Hopefully I'll meet um, Anne, Texas Anne. I'll meet her as well. Can't wait. I love that lady. She's a, she's a lovely, lovely lady. Jay, I'm like, oh, hopefully I'll meet Jay Jones. That'd be awesome to meet Jay. Big D, Hippie Mama, X-Ray. Oh, I'm just so looking forward to it. Oh, I can't wait. Woohoo! Oh, happy tears. Yeah, definitely happy tears. They will be. You know what I'm like. They'll be happy, happy, happy tears meeting everyone. Just thinking about it now, bringing me to tears. We'll get a tissue out, guys. Just thinking about it now. Look good, did it? Uh, that was very inviting. Good morning, Carol. How are you doing, sweetheart? Hope you're doing okay. The legend, yeah, Brother Jay, the man, the myth, the legend. Yeah, I can't wait. I hope I hope I can meet him. I love our brother Jay. I'm gonna buy a better pair of dungarees just to be like his sister. <laughs> we can both go around in our dungarees. <laughs> Oh, Wows, there we go. Welcome to Wows. Oh, yeah, we've got Carol's birthday party tomorrow. Yeah, what, Carol, what time do you, is good for you? Message me or say, and let me know what time is good for you, because I know you've got your grandchildren that you have to see off to school and that. So if you message me and let me know what time, any time's good for us. So just message me and let me know what time's good for you, darling. Oh, I bet it was Trace. I can't wait to meet you all. Tracy, will you be there? I'd love to meet you. Yeah, due to the day of the week. 
night before. So, oh, okay, I've been some nice warm clothes with me. Do I need shorts as well or t-shirts? Do I do, bring a little bit of everything? I'd have a massive suitcase. <laughs> yeah, I threw my big suitcase. I used to have a suitcase that you could fit me in. But we, I'll have to buy another suit. I'll have to get a suitcase. Well, no, we haven't got no suitcases. I'll have to get a suitcase. Oh yeah, I'm going to show uh, Tracy, I'm going to show that picture of Teddy that you sent me the other day. I forgot to say, I forgot to uh, show everyone the other day. Chewing up the hubby's hat. He beautiful. He's so cute. I can't keep it still because the band's bumping everywhere. Oh, he's such a darling. <laughs> he's so cute. I'll tell you about that as you can see. Cool, but not cool. Gets cool at night. We will have a fire sitting. Oh, I can't wait to sit around the fire and have a good chat with everyone. Oh, play a few games and all that. Oh, well, like you do. I've seen you do that. Yeah, I'll bring a mixture of clothes, Mona. I'll bring some warm ones and some shorts and all that. I'll bring a mixture of clothes. To it, Mona. Thanks ever so much for inviting me over there and joining the convoy. Hoping to go join the convoy. Carol, have you heard? I'm coming over to America in November. I'm going to look at the flights tonight, see how much they are. I'm going to fly into where Mona is and I'm going to go on the convoy. If I have to fly into one of the big airports and then get a transfer to it. Yeah, I'll be, yeah. I'll be to get a direct flight. Well, see, I'll have a look into it though. I'll definitely look, I'll look into it tonight. Or... I'll have to fly into JFK and then get a flight from JFK. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I'll tell you anyway when you put when you book up the flight. Yeah. yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'm, look, I'm so, I can't wait, Carol, I can't wait. I've got a big, big smile and happy tears and, oh. Because what we're doing, Carol, is that Terry, will, we're parking up on the 1st of November so Terry can look after, can stay here and look after Aurora and I can fly over and meet everyone. We've got no one to look after Aurora, so T Candyman can't come. But he's all right, he don't mind. He said to me last year, why don't you go over? But um, it was getting to Christmas then, and uh, we thought, well, I'll, I'll come over this year. So November, definitely.
38 miles to go. 38 miles to go. We're taking it slow today because of the weather. You should have seen the, the, the uh, lorries driving past us. They were going some speed, I tell you, earlier. Candyman, yeah, I know. No, no, but someone's got to look after Aurora. I wish we could both go over, but yeah, it's one of them things. I'll be live streaming though, so Candyman can watch what we're doing, watch it all. visa as well. Do I have to get a visa? I do a lot. Well, I have to get a visa as well, don't I? Idea actually, Trace. I'll have to set him up on that one. Trace, you said you'll have to. Uh, one minute, he's concentrating on the road. Alright. Trace, you said you'll have to uh, live stream so we can see you and Aurora. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to set him up on that. Definitely, that's a good one that is, Trace. Yeah, we'll sort that out. I've got the other gimbal. Huh? Got the other gimbal. Yeah, we've got the other gimbal we could use, eh? So, yeah, that'd be a good idea. Who sent the cold weather down here? It's 46 here this morning. Ooh, that's cold for you, Trace. Do you want some of our vape? I'll pass a bit up and send it over. Yeah. Stopped, has it? Two things, eh? Two hundred words. Yeah. Irish. Oh, are they? Yeah. They're going to be going to Pembroke, which is possibly on that guy, fish card. Oh, right. Hasn't stopped raining here since um, nine o'clock this morning, wasn't it? Yeah. Nine o'clock this morning, it's been raining non stop. Just check with bug metric, I'm getting beaten up. It's a bit warm.
trying to save the phones, not getting overheated. We've got the heating on. Obviously, out of the wind screen. Yeah. Do you want me to open the window? No, I've got no heat. Got no heating on. Got no heating on. There's a lot of rain southwest side today. Uh, Two tunnels up there. Huh? I think this is only because there are two tunnels up there. Oh, right. Those, when you are in San Antonio, you can also meet Troublemaker. Oh, yeah, that would be brilliant, to meet Troublemaker. Yeah, definitely, 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 definitely. How is she, Chase? I hope she's doing all right. I found a business before it just I'm so bored. That'd be awesome, Shireen, doing that and opening a shop. Patriot shop. Oh, we've got a bit of traffic now, guys. We knew we'd hit some traffic. Easter weekend, everyone getting away in this horrible, miserable weather. <laughs> There's two tunnels out there as well. One coming this way, one going that way. Oh, well, she, she's had a lot of things keeping her busy. Oh, bless her. Well, at least she's busy. Oh, I'm glad she's doing okay, though, bless her. Say hello to her for me next time you speak to her, Trace. Good, 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 send her my love. I don't have kids tomorrow and hubby took the day off so I will let you know as soon as I know what time is. Okay Carol, yeah, that's fine by us. Like I said, we, 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 any time is good for us. Well, you're happy to take the day off as well. Oh, that's nice of him, take the day off. That's really nice. Cardiff. What? Cardiff. Cardiff. 
you should call it. Probably be raining again tomorrow. <laughs> I think it's not going to be very nice this Easter weekend. You'd think the weather would be getting a bit better by now, wouldn't you? But no, this is the UK. Ah, uh, does it? Oh, you so you should be spoiled, Carol. That's lovely. So you should be spoiled. He sounds like a very kind man. You got a good one there, Carol. Good one. Men are hard to find nowadays. Good job you found me then, wasn't it? Oh, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> I could have been snapped up. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going for the tunnel, guys. We might lose signal. Oh, yeah, we're going for the tunnel. Bear with us. Stick with us. So far. No, didn't lose signal. Woohoo! That was good. How long have you been married, Carol? We are lucky to find good men. Wipe it off. Speed camera. 35 years. Woohoo! <laughs> 35 years. Wow, that's a long time. Me and Candyman have been married, what? 24 years. 24 years. 24. Eight years this year. 24 years. <laughs> <laughs> we've, been, we've only been married eight years this year in September. Is there any mountains where you're going? Yes. Yeah, there is. Is there? Yeah. There is mountains where we're going, but we're going to be right by the sea, Malcolm. Forty years for Tracy and her hubby. Wow! In February. Forty years. That's a long time, Trace, as well. Forty years of happiness.
be a big celebration next year. Forty years. They have to do something very special that next February. Okay, Mona, you take care. Thank you ever so much for coming on. A big kiss and a big hug to you, sweetheart. And uh, I'll let you know about um, the flights and all that. And see what I can find. I've got to message you on Facebook and let you know, darling. Probably cheaper getting a midweek. Yeah, yeah. You have a blessed day, Mona. We love you very much. after we set up for a drink. <laughs> So 30, 40, 50 years is, um, is amazing. It's, uh, it, you're very, you should be proud of yourselves. My mum and dad, if my dad had been alive now, um, I think it would have been 50, 54, 55 years. If my dad had been alive still. Obviously they're still married, but he passed away. But yeah, my mum and dad would have been yeah, about, around about 54, 55, maybe, maybe more than that. Oh, 
43 years of Slim and Shireen, 43 years in on August the 15th. Well, that's going to be a celebration in August. Do you remember that date? August the 15th. They do, Carol. People do quit too early these days, yeah. They do, they do, they do. They come across a hard time and that's it. They break up. You've got to fight through these things together. That's what marriage is all, is all about fighting through hard times and enjoying the good times. We've fought through a few things, haven't we? We've had fought through a few things in the eight years we've been married, yes. Definitely. We've got there, though. Yeah. Because we, we fought through it, we're now living the dream. Yeah. A little bit of uh, bright sky coming up. A little bit of bright sky, it's a bit, oh, let's just hope that might be a bit better. Yeah, you've got to work at marriage. Work ain't, marriage ain't easy, but you, you know, you've got to work at it. You know, if you're best friends as well. And I think with marriage, it's all about trust. Trust is a big, big thing in marriage. If you haven't got trust in a marriage or any relationship, really, it's not going to work out. You've got to have trust. I told him he is stuck with me. I'm not trading another one. <laughs> That's what I say, Carol. That's what I say. Everyone argues. If they say they don't, I don't believe them. No, nor do I, Carol. I don't believe them either. Everyone argues. And that's what you've got to get through. You've got to get through them bad times, the arguments. Everyone does. And like I'm like you, Carol. If you, if you say to me that you don't argue, you're in a happy marriage and you don't argue, I'm sorry, but I don't believe a word you're saying. Everyone, every marriage has their arguments. Some more than ever. But me and Candyman, we argue. We tickle, we uh, bicker at each other. But we we make up, don't we? We we're okay. We the next day we get through it and we're smiling again. Again. The next day is always another day. What happened yesterday is history. That's right. Especially when they have different political politics. Yeah, definitely Dollar A, yeah. Pots flying. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of, yeah, especially when they've got different uh, politic views. Lucky enough, me and Candyman have got the same politic views. It's fun making up. <laughs> but yeah, 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 everyone, and like I said, trust is a big thing. If you don't have trust in a marriage, then you've not you've not got a oh, I'm going out any relationship. You know, you haven't got a you haven't got a relationship. Oh, it's going fast. Speeding along. You don't have one speeding along. They're probably going to Barry. Yeah. But look, Candyman said you'll never die. The next day is another day, you know, you wake up. And uh, it's all forgotten. He's speeding along as well. Look, look, can he race them free? I'll race them. No, you won't. Okay. Yeah, I'll race them. 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 Yeah, I'll race them.
Yeah. <laughs> Way too heavy. They've probably got nothing in their bags. I'll tell Slim I don't argue, I only explain why I'm right. Yeah, quite right, Shereen. <laughs> I always say to Cody, man, you know I'm always right. <laughs> the only thing with Cody, man, he doesn't take responsibility if he's done anything wrong. <laughs> he just doesn't take responsibility. <laughs> But yeah, he knows I'm always right. I say to him, you should listen to me. Why don't you listen to me? Happy life, yeah, quite right, Carol. I've said that to Candy Man many, many times. <laughs> and I, happy wife, happy life. Teddy says it's playtime. <laughs> What's he playing with today, Trace? Has he chewed up your hubby's hat yet? <laughs> the other dogs right now. Oh, I bet that wears him out playing with the other dogs. Oh. I'll have to meet Teddy as well when I come over. And all your other doggies. Jam one, shouldn't I? Really does. Oh. 
Well, you went in the shop the other day and didn't buy me that thing. I remember that, Mrs. McBride. Ah, you need to get get him a little haircut, Teddy needs a haircut. Oh, Tracy's going to phone the groomers. Oh, Tracy's going to phone the groomers. Tracy's going to phone the I go April the 2nd and 3rd for my heart test. Oh, okay, but well, we'll keep doing our prayers. Third and the second. Good job it's not on uh, the first, eh? Yeah, hit the like button, guys. On your way in or on your way out. If you haven't already. I did get a copyright for the other... Uh, for the uh, the live stream I did the other day in town, and they blocked part of the uh, the video again because of the music. I knew that would happen. Angelina, hi darling, how you doing? Nice of you to come on. Hello, hello, hello. Got a bit of rain today, Angelina. <laughs> Not a bit, got quite a bit, a lot. <laughs> okay, Bert, see you in a bit. Ooh, got a nice little bit of sun coming out. Well, prayers for your mummy, uh, Angelina. Take the next left towards A4232, towards Barry. Towards Barry. No, do you know what that reminds me of, Gavin and Stacey? <laughs> but they go the other way, aren't they, to Essex, but when she goes, Bill and Rico. Bill Looks like you are driving out of the rain. Yeah, hopefully, Angelina. Yeah, it's not been good today. Hopefully, we're going, we'll have a bit of sun while we're putting up the all in because we got absolutely soaked this morning. Sat nav's telling him to slow down, Trace. Let's hope this bang stops while we're uh, setting up. You never know, they might let us in a little bit earlier, right? It does us up no one's on our pitch. Well, I've got to go in reception anyway. I'll be listening to time to feed the animals. Okay, try you go feed the beautiful animals. Happy referee shirt, why are you there? <laughs> Hi Mark, how you doing mate? How you doing 
okay today. Good morning to you. Good morning to Cindy as well. Bless her. you guys didn't hear I'm coming over to America in November Candyman will be staying at home with Aurora but I'm going to be flying over I'm going to be going in the convoy with Mona fly out on the 4th or the 5th of November, maybe the 6th, I'm not quite sure yet, I have to have a look at the flights and see what it's like, but I'll be looking into the flights uh, later on this evening and uh, hopefully get that booked up. I'm looking forward to it, Angelina. I can't wait. That's breaking news, not fake news, everyone. Rose is coming. Yay! Yeah, it's it's not fake news. It's breaking news. Well, yeah, correct, Donna Exactly. Convoy on it. Yes, yes. I'm coming out. I'm going to come over for the one on the uh, 9th of November. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. I'm going to ride in uh, Mona's truck. She came on earlier on and she's invited me over and um, said that I could ride in her truck. Looking forward to it. Oh, Buffalo Man and Buffalo, uh, uh, I love them too. Yards, oh, in April, yeah. Yeah, it's very exciting, Angelina. I can't wait. I'm so looking forward to it. Because what what will happen is that we park up on the 1st of November for four months. So Candyman can stay here and look after Aurora. And I can fly over to America. And he'll be all packed, parked up and settled. And I can come over. I love Buffalo Man. He's lovely. He's what a great guy he is. And his wife as well. She's a lovely lady. Yeah, so Donna Ray's right. Breaking news, guys. Breaking news. Ooh, smash the like button. Don't forget to smash that like button on your way in or your way out. If you haven't already. What I do is sooner as when I uh, we book it up and uh and then I'll put um, everything on my community page and let you guys know or do a live and let you guys know what's happening. We'll see. The roundabout, taking the third exit. Got to see how much it all is yet. Take the third exit towards A4050 to Cardiff Airport, Mysore and Cadet. <laughs> Thank you, Mark, for putting them up. I'm coming to America. Oh, shoot, you're going that way. 
He was going that way. Well, I don't care where he's going. Can't read the beat read the billboards, they're all in Welsh. <laughs> <laughs> That's like what they say in Gavin and Stacey, isn't it? Why do you have the billboards are written in Welsh when no one speaks the language? <laughs> Some people do. Um We've only got a little while left. 11 miles to go. We've got 11 miles to go, Mark. Um, we've been on the road since quarter to ten this morning. I was going to go. Candyman said to me, you're going to go live. I said, well, it's too early over in America at the moment. It was like quarter to six over there. So I was like, nah, I'll wait a little while. Now I've been live for an hour and a half, so. Hi, Kim! How you doing, sweetheart? Hope you're doing all right. I've got breaking news for you, Kim. Breaking, breaking news. <coughs> Kim, I'm coming to America. I'm coming in America. I'm coming in November. I'm going to go and ride in the convoy. 350 yards, go over the roundabout, taking the second exit onto Port Road. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Drum roll. Yeah, hello. Are you, I'm going to have to come and you're going to have to come to the convoy, Kim, with me. I want to ride with you. Go over the roundabout. Mona's invited me to ride in her truck. So, my darling, you're gonna have to come and be in the convoy with me. Oh, definitely, definitely, definitely. Oh, God, that I will come to America and not meet you, sweetheart. Definitely. I don't know how long I'm gonna be there for. Hopefully about two or three weeks. I, I'm hoping. Um, we'll see. No point in coming all the way over there just for one week. I want to be there quite a bit. So I'm going to look at. I'm going to look at the flights and see. Uh, hopefully, Mark. I, I want to be over there for about two, two to three weeks. Uh, it's no point in flying all over that way just for a week. There's no point in that. The last time I went over to America, well, the set two times I went over to America, to Orlando, I went for three weeks. So, yeah, going to be hopefully two to three weeks. Yeah, I know, Mark. I, I, I don't know if to fly over on election day. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Because the convoy is on the 9th of November. It starts on the 9th of November, so I don't know yet. I'm going to try and fly over on a weekday because it'll be cheaper. I'm going to have to have a look at the dates and everything. J6s out. Enter the roundabout, take the second exit.
there quite right uh, Angelina close the border and open the jail cells 3J6 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 definitely try to get him out he's already said that he's promised that come for the White House Biden for the jail house yoohoo all of them for the jail house, Ferg. All of them. Every single bloody one of them. Put them in solitary confinement, see how they bloody like it. After 350 yards, enter the roundabout, take the second exit, on to Port Road. Barry. It's starting to rain again now, look. At that little bit of sunshine. Enter the roundabout, take the second gone. exit. I'll be singing that all the time now. <laughs> Face is back, animals are fed. Welcome back, Face. Is Teddy still running around with all the other doggies? Or has he, been, or has he got his food now? Puppy food. <laughs> Our candy man's driving okay today. He's being careful because it's so wet on the roads, um, Mark. So he's not. Do he's doing. He's being very careful today. Does it seem very windy out there? It's a bad no. At least we got over the bridge before the wind anyway. But yeah, he's doing alright. He's outside. <laughs> Bless him. Little Teddy. Yeah, so uh, Candyman's driving very like, safely today. And I said to him to drive safely because I know what uh, Sweet Home Alabama Kim says, you've got precious cargo on. I said that to him earlier. Beep, beep, boat runner. <laughs> it's not a very good boot like that one, is it? Hey, there we go. Oh, thank you, Mark. Yeah, trying to put a few shorts up, you know. Uh, see how they go. See if we get a few more subscribers. I like the England one, like the Kit Kat, the uh, countryside one. That was a good one. Yeah, that's what I said. I said that to uh, Candyman earlier, Kim. You got precious cargo on board. No speeding today, no, not today, Trace. Okay, Angelina, thank you ever so much for coming on. You have a blessed day. We love you, girl. Big kiss and a big hug to you. That, that, the beautiful views there where uh, I could do some shorts here I do lots of shorts here at Barry yeah. and I'll definitely let you know Kim when we're going to Cardiff Castle I'll, I'll give you a heads up on that one 
um, a day or before we go or two days before we go. We're not going to go there till after Easter because it's going to be absolutely jammed, packed in Cardiff uh, over the Easter period. So um, we'll leave that till after Easter because we're going to be at Barry for 11 nights. So we've got plenty of time. But I will give you a couple of days notice on that one, Kim. Yeah. It'll be, it'll be good going there again. But like I said, it, it, Cardiff's going to be absolutely packed this Easter. It always, it, everywhere. Some people, places like that are always packed over the Easter period. So we're going to wait until everyone's gone back to work and uh, go after that. Yeah, it is awesome. Yeah, I had some guy as well uh, put on one of my, a couple of my shorts today, actually, um, saying, oh, I'm not going to get that many views if I haven't got something on my on my channel. I just deleted his name off. I blocked him. I don't want people. I don't, it doesn't bother me whether my videos go viral or not because I've got my little family chat and my family on here. So I'm not really bothered whether they go viral or whatever, do you know what I mean? So I'm quite happy with what I've got. I'm quite happy building my channel up slowly. I don't need all that. I mean, it, it is building up slowly, slowly, you know. That's how I like to do it. I don't want, no, I'm not bothered about, about things going viral, I'm not like that. Mean people suck, yeah. Carol, I don't, you know, you don't need to tell me that like, uh, like my videos are not going to go viral. I don't really care if they go viral or not. I don't want trolls in here. I'd rather just have my, my family on here. My friends, you know, you're my family and I love having my family. It's a lovely little chat we've got here. We've got a Patriot Patriot chat, family chat, and that's what I like. What? After 350 yards, enter the roundabout. Oh, gotcha. Take the second exit. Once you want to stop somewhere and do that. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Enter the roundabout. Take the second exit. There's a labour. Whee! We're just going to stop and open the water valve. We forgot to do it to let all the water out. All the waste water, not toilet water, waste water. That's enough to drink, I'll have a toilet water. No, you won't. Yes, I will. I'll do it here right now. We do have the best family chat, Mark. Uh, Mark. We do. We do have the best family on here. Well, like I said, I don't need, I don't need my videos or my lives or anything like that going viral. I know people want to go viral, but I don't. Yeah, I'm not bothered about that. Let's just turn. Hello. Hi, guys. <laughs> I'm going to finish my skip. See you all later. Bye. Okay, Malcolm, you take care. Big kiss and a big hug to you. Thank you ever so much for coming on. We'll see you soon. Oh, I don't know who's got the coffee pot. Someone said, um, I wonder who put the coffees round earlier. Lisa usually puts the coffees on, but she's not on today, bless her. Anyone can fill Kim's coffee cup up. Coffee cup up. Refill, please.
handyman's having a toilet break. You men, tell ya. Oh, I've heard quick, co quick coffee, can't feel about We have a 32 cup pot. He was welcome to fresh up cup, cup of coffee. There we go. Shireen's got a pot full of coffee. I've had to turn the heating off in there in case my phone that overheats, but now I'm getting a bit chilly. That was quick. Did you open the valve? Yeah. Nothing coming out. Oh yeah, there is. Not as much as there usually is. But. Maybe I can't see it because of the rain. Look at those from the heat for a minute. heat on because the wind is screaming up so if my phone gets overheated I will come back on we'll see what happens we're all going to go and live at Shereen's I'm going to go and swim in a swimming pool, watch telly, and have a drink at a bar. for you, uh, Shireen. We're here for you, yeah. We're here. All the family's here for you, Shireen. This is all this weather. It's quite dark. Got lights on. You'd think it was like nearly five, six o'clock at night, wouldn't you? Yeah. Three and a half miles to go. You think it'll clear in three and a half miles? <laughs> I don't think so. Looks like we're going to be putting up the all in in the wet. Never mind. I've just told you how to be up. chat here we do Shireen we do we do we do that's what I love about my chat is just it's such it is a family family chat and we don't need uh <laughs> and I don't need my uh, live streams to go by all my videos all my shorts because that bloke's an idiot um, so I got rid of him I deleted him off my channel this morning. After three and a half 
Oh, at least it's not stormy long. Well, let's hope not, Kim. Because I think it's going to get worse this afternoon. DJ Lightning, lately, like I said that on the uh, weather. Putting up the awning and we'll get struck by lightning. Oh, Lord. <laughs> yeah, the, the air is still standing up on end. Oh, is it raining there as well, Mark? Oh, a little oval. What is the weather doing nowadays? Raining, snowing, where's the sand? Miles per hour. Slow down. Where? All over the world. Oh. You heard that candy man. I'm going to give you a speeding ticket. Oh, <laughs> I'm only doing 20 miles an hour. Looks a bit early on the camera, but I think that's just where we can have some rain and everything. The game's very smart, you know, that loud. <laughs> How many miles of chocolates do you owe so far? Woo! Shireen, I hope it's there for me as well. I'm gonna go in reception when we get there and uh, oh, we're there, we're here. We're coming the other way, right? Other way, aren't we? Turn sharp right, then arrive at waypoint on the left. Yeah, we've come in the other way, we came in that way before, didn't we? Take the 
Next right. Then turn short right. Any of you guys remember this campsite? Yeah, the barriers there. Just park up here and I'll just wander in because you've got to reverse back, haven't you? Or go up there and turn around. Shut up, for fuck's sake. Recalculating. Turn back at the roundabout, taking the third exit. No, it's not a right. uh, mark, no. Kim remembers it. That was a trick. Shereen remembers it. You go up there, can't you? you got to go round and through that barrier up there. Just park. Oh. Is there someone behind you? Yeah. Oh, fucking prick. Sorry, guys, about my language. You'll have to come up and go round, back round again. There's always one, isn't there? Recalculating. At end of the road, turn right. There's always one. We had some bloke right up our bum. After 200 yards, mm -hmm. turn left, then turn oh, that's all right, Carol. Go on, my foot. No, we're over there. Yeah, it's very wet, Donovan. <laughs> very, very wet. We had some bloke right up our bum. He was hooting Terry to get out of the way. So we've had to go all round the bloody Take campsite. The short left, then turn left. Like the barrier is there to get in. So where's your to go? Just park up here. Or we can get into the barrier. I can walk up to reception. Right, guys, I'll be back in a minute. I'm just going to walk up to reception. It's only... Yeah, someone else is just coming now. Hello, baby Jill.
And subscribe to my channel. Woohoo! Right, we can go straight in. Where? Up here? Yeah, barrier number 3357. Welcome in. Yeah, we got the parcel from Shireen. Woohoo! Pitch number 23, so straight up. Three, five, seven. But Candyman was ignoring us. Was he? I wasn't. I'm searching Oh, he was searching for his coat. Ah, hi, Donna. How you doing, darling? Thank you so much for saving our parcels. That is Donna Price. She's one of the ladies that work on the reception. She's a lovely lady. Three, three, five, seven. Did you press enter? No or you might have to go a bit forward. I don't know. I don't know if Donna's still on. Oh, you're a bit near, aren't you? Going a little bit backwards. We can't get through the barrier. I'm putting glasses on, I can't see. Bell, they talk to you. Hey, Hi, I'm at the barrier. I pushed the code up. Oh, yeah, they don't put their check-ins on the two o'clock. They don't work till right, but I'll come back to you exactly when now. Thank you. Okay, go. Oh, there we go. 
The sun is coming out. Yay! Yeah, let's hope it stops right. We'll put this uh, all in up and get everything out. And uh, what number? Number 23. Look, you go up. There. Over this way. And yeah. Number 20, that way. 21, 26. Yeah. Number 25, 26, next one. There's 24. Four, twenty-five. Next one. It's this one. Oh no, twenty-two, twenty-three. Yeah, twenty-three. This one. One minute, guys. Candy man is concentrating. Mind his. Is there? No. Oh, Orlin's going to be right up on the grass. No, I've got to get right over yet. Oh, yeah? yeah. Oh. Oh. No, go on, go on. I'm shutting my eyes. I'm shutting my eyes. Good, Good idea. Kim, oh no. Okay, guys, we're stuck. <laughs> Candy man always does this. We're stuck in the wet grass. The guys are helping us, bless them. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about this. Oh, 
Oh dear. Trust us, guys. Trust us. For real. Oh, look at that! We was well and truly stuck. I don't give me a lot of room here, do I? <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, behind me, yeah, there is people in the world. Huh? <laughs> wow. I thought we were going to be stuck there forever. <laughs> we've got to try and get over, haven't we? Morning, Slim. Don't go in the grass again. No. <laughs> I'm not going in there again. Oh, that nice, the nice guys. If it weren't for them, we wouldn't have got out of there. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, I've got to try and level this up now. Yeah, we've got to try and level this van up now, guys. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my heart was in my mouth then. I'm <laughs> sorry, I never said goodbye. My heart was in my mouth then, guys. I was holding my breath for day of life. We sunk. <laughs> Cup yeah, you get the cup for sinking the, the motor home. Oh, blimey. My heart was in my, my, my heart was in my mouth. Oh, let's get this all in up before it starts bloody raining again. <laughs> we'll have a fag first. Oh. Whew. Trina, Slim. Oh, breaking, breaking news for you guys. We'll have to go on the grass a bit. I don't think we should. Oh, the all in, yeah, the all in will go on the grass. I don't, I'm not bothered about that. I don't think the van should go on the I grass, though. No more. I don't think the van should go on the grass. Oh, is he? Oh, bless him. Is he all right? He's been banged his head bad. <laughs> Oh God! What? A, what? A, oh, I bet. Uh, I hope Donna wasn't watching that. <laughs> Bye, let me, yeah, we will. We actually, yeah, we could do that. Yeah, we do. We'll ask them if they want to drink tonight in the clubhouse. Yeah, it's a good idea. That is, um, Trace. Yeah, we're buying a drink.
Yeah, good idea. They seem nice neighbours, so that's good. Terry's gone over to have his word with the guy. Share, share some fudge with them. Yeah. Oh, we can share some chocolate cake tomorrow with them. When oh, everyone's got to come on for Carol's birthday tomorrow. Don't know what time we're doing it yet, but we're doing we're doing a celebration for Carol's birthday tomorrow. And we can share some chocolate cake with them. I'm sure they're like that. But oh boy, my my, my heart was in my mouth. I knew he was going to get stuck. He forgets it's been raining. He should know this. See, he used to drive a mobile crane. <laughs> He's got to level this van up yet. Because we're sloping down like that. I was shaking. I still am a little bit. So I got my parcel, Shireen. Did you see? Got my parcel. I'll open that up on a live uh, later on, probably later on this evening. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do have it on video. <laughs> That'd be good to look back on. We'll open that up later on. Is he alright, bless him? Did he bang his head bad? Huh? Is he alright? Yeah. He only banged his head. Now we're going to get this all in up first, Trace, and then I'll open it. I'll do another live later and open it up. We've got to get this all in up before it starts raining again. You said it's hardly rained here. Yeah. Oh, said, really? Yeah. You said they've had a couple of little tours down. Yeah. You said, but you said nothing too. too oh, that's all right then. You said, how's it been for you? You said, where have you come from? I said, come up from Devon this morning. Yeah. Uh, Dogset. He went, oh, you said, you've had a fair... Trip. He said, what's the weather been like? I said, hey, it ain't stopped raining yet. I said, it's the first time it stopped. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, op I'll open the parcel up later when we're settled and everything. And um, I'll do another live stream. Oh, that's a show, isn't it? Yeah, I'll do another live stream and uh, maybe take you into the clubhouse and uh, you can have a look around there. He used to drive a mobile crane. What's happened to you? <laughs> Look like I got a cup for sinking him. <laughs> dear, oh dear. That was fun, wasn't it, guys, eh? <laughs> Everything always happens to us. Is that dry? No. Hmm. I'll have to put the other ones on. There's a recipe in there as well, isn't it? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because that's what Shireen said. We have to buy him a drink. Yeah, for helping us. Yeah. Shireen said that would make him some fudge. Mm -hmm. I said, we're doing a chocolate cake for Carol's birthday tomorrow, so we'll give him some chocolate cake as well. Yeah. See how easy it is to make fudge. Yeah. See if we've got the ingredients in the shop. I said, they don't give you a lot of room here. Do they I? don't. I don't remember it being this small, do you? No, over there. We'll be all right. 
I don't remember it being this small. These pitches. And we've got a puddle over there, but that's going to be where the opening of the... Yeah, Put that back there. Right. Shall we get cracking? Wait. Wait. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. I'm going to... Okay, guys, I'm going to shut this live stream down and uh, we're going to crack on and get this all in up and get all the stuff out. And then I'll come back on later and we'll do a parcel opening from Shireen. Uh, I don't know what time yet. I'll put something on my community page. So keep an eye on my community page. I'll put a time on there on my community page and let you know what time I'm coming on. Uh, we'll open the parcel and then we'll take you over to the clubhouse and we'll go and have a drink over there. We're going to have a beer. We're going to have a beer or a glass of wine. So I'll give you a couple of few minutes to say goodbye to each other. And I hope you all have a blessed day. And um, thanks ever so much for coming on. So hit that like button when you go, go out. If you haven't already, if you're a new subscriber, hit the notification bell, guys, because you'll know when you'll, we go live. And um, it's always fun, it's always fun to have us on here, to everyone on here. Thank you ever so much. Donna Ray, take care. Big kiss and a big hug to you, sweetheart. Kim, my darling, I love you, sweetheart. Big kiss and a big hug. Oh, Tracy, see you later, darling. Big kiss, big hug, Carol. Big kiss, big hug. We'll see you all later. <sighs> right Trina! big kiss and a big hug to your sweetheart and uh, we will see you all later for a big uh, opening up and for drinkies so make sure you've got your coffee or your orange juice or whatever glass of wine beer whatever you want and we'll all go for a drink thanks Kim for putting that up yeah, if you'd like to donate, go towards my Florida flight, uh, go towards my flight to America. That'd be awesome. I'll be saving for my flight now to America in November. Going on the convoy with everyone. So right, guys, I'll see you all later. Bye, love you. See you later. See you in a bit. Bye.